Hey guys, hey friends, how's it going? It's NTP, another producer. I hope everybody's doing good. Um, you know what I'm saying? Just drop a song called um, uh, Fall For Me. Uh, we're gonna break down the, the song uh, like we usually do. And um, you know what I'm saying? And um, you know what I'm saying? If you can uh, go and uh, check it out on Spotify, iTunes, iTunes Apple Music, and uh, all, all, all the on uh, digital platform, I really appreciate it from, from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. And um, you know what I'm saying follow me on Instagram for previews and stuff like that. And um, yeah, but today, um, you know what I'm saying, I'm just gonna break down this song real quick. And um, you know, we usually start with the uh, instrumental like we usually do, and, and then we do the vocals. Uh, now, let's, um, I'm gonna just play like a, a little bit of the beat so you guys can hear uh, what it sounds like. Uh, nothing, nothing too complicated, you know. So, uh, let's hear a little bit. Okay guys, so that's the whole beat and um, you know what I'm saying, um, you know, just to have an idea what the beat sound like. So, uh, uh, our kid, you know what I'm saying, I went to the, you know, I chose the melody. Uh, mm, I'm going to go with that later. Uh, but, you know, our kid, let's start with our kid first and I went with the melody. Uh, this is what the interface look like. Uh, this right here, the drip thing, uh, drip, and it's called Cyber True, you know what I'm saying? It's a whole bunch of samples there. And uh, the first one will be this. I duplicate it, and then uh, I added this. for the melody and now uh hi hats you know what I'm saying going hi hats you know what I'm saying nothing crazy just left it like that oh by the way the I put on um, CLA 76 um H compressor and then uh, uh another compressor on it so I put two compressor on the second vocal on the second uh, melody so now the hi hats. Let's 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 look into the hi hats. I hats from uh, ultra drums. You know what I'm saying. And it's a sample. I drag. You know, you go on drag and, and drop, and you just drop a sample of. You know what I'm saying. And then you just kind of go from there. So uh, let's let's say the hi hats. Very basic. I usually put like stuff on the hi hats, but uh, this beat is old. Like I did it like a long time ago, and when I opened the template, that hi hat just sounded good for me. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna just go. I'm gonna just leave the hi hat like that. So uh, you know what I'm saying. And then when I recorded it, so when I opened this template, and I wanted to record it, so I'm like, you know, what? I'm just gonna leave this beat like this. The only thing I added was the iterating, and that's I just went from there. Uh, now let's uh let's check the clap. You know what I'm saying? Let's check out the clap. And uh, okay, so that's the clap. And um, 
Now the 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 kick. All right, so pretty simple. It's a pretty simple beat, you know what I'm saying? Nothing crazy. Now, um, last, lastly, uh, we're gonna touch on the edit. So the edit, I did it on, on two. I did it, um, you know what I'm saying? Two different uh, loop. So I went on in Logic and then just choose uh, the Q sample, you know what I'm saying? A big chopper edit. And uh, you know, so Jack dropped the sample and then just went on the keys. And what I'm putting on it is uh, the R bass, uh, 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 a clipper, you know what I'm saying? Clipper from T Rax clipper. And then I'm putting the distortion on the bass. So let's hear it. So that's the whole bass, and that's the that's the whole beat. And uh, one thing I did lastly is, uh, if you see, I'ma just go, I'ma just go there. This whole drum set right here that I did, I'm gonna play for you real quick. This whole drum set right here. Okay, uh, let's go. All right, so that's without the um the iterate. So what I did was uh I bounced the wave file and then I created another file, and that's you know I call it four by four bar B, and that's what you that's what you hear at the beginning like this. So let's hear it. So now what I did on this was uh, pretty simple. Um, Pro Q3, you know what I'm saying? Give it that telephone sound to the beat and then uh, neo verb uh you know what i'm saying uh i did a video on neo verb and, and you know kind of explaining why i use it on drums and uh put l2 just to give it some uh just uh, put a limit uh limit like as a limiter and that's the whole beat and then you know what i'm saying and then that's it. So lastly, right before we finish, lastly, uh, oh, snap. What I did on the B is the auto fill. You know what I'm saying? I usually try to add something interesting to the B. So uh, let's hear that real quick. This is called Sensory Sweep. So it's basically sweeping and uh, you know what I'm saying? The filters, uh, the frequencies. All right, so that's it. That's the whole beat, you know what I'm saying? And uh, drum, bass, uh, uh, melody, guitar, uh, nothing complicated. Uh, so now, um, now I'm saying play the whole thing. Uh, from that, to, uh, from the transition to to that. Uh, let's see, let's turn on the uh, very simple beat. Now I'm saying. So let me see. Uh, for you want to.
right, guys. So that's the whole beat. If you like this video, like, comment, share, subscribe. Uh, I'm gonna do part two, which is gonna be the vocal. Uh, see you guys.